It's our big story at 10, Thanksgiving Eve, also known nationwide as Blackout Wednesday. Police see a spike in binge drinking and drunk driving on this night. Bar owners and local law enforcement working to make sure things don't get out of hand. NBC 26's Alex Hagan is live at 10 with a word of caution. Stacy, bar owners in downtown Green Bay say tonight is one of the busiest times of the year as college students come home looking to party, and that can lead to big trouble. The night before Thanksgiving, a time for people to come together and celebrate the holidays. We get a great amount of business from that. Good for bars like Stadium View and Fitzgerald's Irish Pub. Younger crowd, um, do a lot of, lot of drinking. In there lies the problem. Students returning from college, many striving to. People leaving drunk. Black out, according to the Centers for Disease Control. Starting tonight until New Year's Day, about 730 people will be injured or killed in drunk driving accidents nationwide. We want people to have a good time, but we want it to do so safe. In Brown County alone, 92 citations issued during last Thanksgiving weekend. The Brown and Manitowoc County OWI Task Force are out tonight. A warning for students. They need to realize that they're not in college anymore in the sense that they're back home and, and we'll definitely be looking for them. And so will bar owners. We call them taxis and make sure they get home safe. Stadium View doubling their staff, increasing security. Our staff definitely makes sure that everyone's safe when they go out on the roads after being here. Making sure if you're going to drink, you do so responsibly. Now, the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention defines binge drinking for women as four or more drinks, and for men, five or more drinks, something law enforcement hopes people keep in mind. Alex Hagan, NBC 26. Thank you, Alex.